is beautiful out here. There's the mountain. Mount Hood. Our goal is to summit via the pearly gates. Here with my friend Chris, we did this uh, a few years ago, um, and I've been up several times since, but I think it's been a few years for him, so hoping to have success. We have great conditions, uh, it's a short weather window, so I think we'll be able to have success with this. First, I gotta fix this diesel heater. Um, uh, huh? <laughs> Myself. All right, it's cold as shit outside, but we got the diesel heater running. So we're gonna be warm in here. It's set to 100 degrees, literally. <laughs> Obviously, that's not how we're gonna sleep, but we're gonna test it out like that. It is cooking. This is climbing in luxury. Today's just one of those days where, like, you just don't feel good on the mountain. I'm having one of those. <laughs> I think it's okay because like we got to where we are pretty quickly it's so cold so we're not necessarily in a hurry um, and like ultimately feel pretty good but definitely moving slower than usual that's all right we'll get there Chris up there, he's feeling great. It's good for him. So, all right, the sun comes up, I'll get some motivation. So you guys can see the moon there. So I cover my headlamp. It's a beautiful night. We're uh, getting pretty close to the Devil's Kitchen now. Um, good because we've been moving for two and a half hours so I feel like we're going slow but you know it's actually pretty good and honestly no sign of the sun yet so really no point in hustling at this point um, might get a sunrise on the summit so stay tuned for that we'll see if, that, if we can make that happen just so happy with these conditions though that we're getting beautiful window because tomorrow night there's supposed to be a pretty good weather system rolling in but probably not gonna make it out on the, oh I think it might the uh, it's beautiful the stars clear. gotta love nights like this on the mountain it's like what mr. Rogers says is a beautiful day in the neighborhood <laughs> That's way better than last time. We're at the base of the gates. Hell yeah, guys. Beautiful day. Glad we're able to be out here. You can see the rest of Oregon over there. 
hogs back. Right gate definitely looks a little bit more treacherous like usual. Not too bad, definitely doable. This ain't no two tool business, this is nothing bro. The shoot over on the right, you're almost able to like get good pressure so you can stand up. Yeah? Well, I say that and then I stop, so it don't listen to me. It had been. <laughs> oh, dude, we gotta get a picture of that. Look at this gnarly snow sculpture there. To your left. Oh, wow. Um. <laughs> well, that's faster than the last time we were in here. Yeah. Huh? What the f are you doing up there? Well, we are getting into some ice. I mean, you're almost able to just to outright walk this. Which is basically what I'm doing. I'm barely using the axe just to, enough to give me stabilization. Yeah. I say this and when I fall I'm going to regret the fact that I said that. Yeah. I mean to be honest with you, got a little PTSD from my fall so yeah, I, I take things kind of precautionary. We're pretty much out of the thick of it here. Going down, it's not going to be fun. No. But I think you just got to have a little bit of faith in your uh, legs and your crampons, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah. I see what he's talking about. <laughs> Look behind you. Jesus. I can see how he's got that feeling. Yeah, no Try to boogie down this mountain as fast as possible. Man, this just feels so good right now, be in the sun.
So we put on a pretty damn good performance, I think. Good. Start down climb that. Yeah. yeah. We'll let you get away. What's up? I'm gonna let you get away. Yeah, please. <clears throat> oh, this looks awful. Don't look back. Yeah. I see what old boy is talking about, though. Yeah. Oh yeah. Got a bit of pucker. Yeah, I wouldn't have came down this way with one axe. This ain't no two-tool business. This is nothing, bro. Where did I fall in? Over here? Over there. Yeah. Just remember our route? We had to search these little cliffs a bit. Yeah. So I know you guys are probably curious about the shrine, so. Basically non existent. Well, if I fall through, that, that'll change. I don't know. Probably, probably just go all the way down to the sun hoodie. What'd you say? I said I'm going to strip and probably go all the way down to the sun hoodie. Yeah, I don't think the borealis is necessary in the sun. No, I mean it might be chilly sitting there, but yeah, we don't need to stop for. We'll strip, break, and then straight to the vehicle. back to the van uh well if you think we deserve it please consider subscribing that would definitely help us out a lot had a lot of fun today hope you guys enjoyed watching and i'll see you at the